Evening guys, welcome back to Warehouse Workshop. Um, we're quite deep into the quarantine period now, I'm not going to mention the name of the thing that's going around, um, YouTube don't seem to like it. Uh, so I've decided to get myself out of the house and uh, get into the workshop and scrap something for you. Nothing's too serious tonight, no gold recovery tonight. Um, I will probably in the next video do some gold recovery for you. Um, I've got a lot of circuit boards to strip out, which is going to take me for an age, so I'm just going to do them gradually. But tonight we've got, um, tell you what, when you're over in the house, you know, walking around with a hoover, you must, do you ever think to yourself, what's in that hoover? Well, tonight, wonder no more, for we have one of the best hoovers on the market. Da, 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 da. The Henry Hoover. Now I'm just going to drop the camera now, so you won't see my beautiful face anymore. That's if it works properly. Brace yourselves. And there she blows. Right, so what we're going to get out of this tonight is there should be one of these in the bottom of it. Copper windings on there. So that's what we're going for. A bit of valley on top. Probably not going to strip all of this down, we're just going to get that the main section out and try and dismantle this part as well. These are actually copper in this one, which is a bonus. A couple of some of them can be copper coated alley, which is a bit of a letdown. But you don't know really until it, I think it's on the newer ones that they've realised that copper's getting too expensive or was getting too expensive, so they changed it. What I have done is I've removed the screws prior to that because nobody wants to see that's boring. There we go. Oh, more. Right. So that goes into our plastics recycling. Now, I don't think there was a lot from the previous ones I've done. I don't think there was a lot in this top here. I think I was just being cheap because there's some brass and copper in there. But we'll show it for the camera. Oh, my voice is going. <laughs> so yeah, I hope everybody's staying safe. Plastic. Yeah, yeah so there's a bit, of, a bit of cable left in there. Bit of brass there. We'll take them off. Yeah, I hope everybody's staying safe and adhering to staying indoors, stopping the, the spread. It's uh, difficult times, strange times. Now we're going household cable. Steel screws, right? I'm going to keep that to one side. I'm going to knock them bits of brass off. Oh, hang on. Let's get it off now. Brass. Tiny, tiny bits of brass in there, I'll knock them out later. Better than no, keep it to one side. Brass. Yeah, so that's a bit different. Rubbish. 
So this looks like it was a, an even older one. By the wear on it. On there. I've got to tell you as well, for all those people who who know me and watch the videos and say, God, you look freezing in that workshop. This is almost tropical in here. It's almost embarrassing it's so warm. And I've got my fan going as well up there. And it's still tropical. But good to keep an airflow going. Switches. Keep them. It's got some brass in it. I know, I know it's only it's only tiny but it's brass. Can't let it go. Oh I'm gonna fight on now. Is that not? Yes. Uh bit of cable, bit of brass on the ends of those. Again all little bits add up and some of this will go as um, the smaller gear to melt and make a little puddle when I get uh, the foundry going so I'll cut off all the little bits rather than having big lumps in just take off all the little bits get a little bit of stock melted in the bottom so plastic plastic Let's get into this. I'm intrigued. Feel right, got you. Being an idiot. Just see my gut on the camera. Jesus. Suck it in, boys. Can't even suck it in. So if, uh, if you're new to this channel, um, give me other, uh, other vids a watch. I would have put something up in the top corner, but I'm having trouble editing all my vids at the minute. So this one, I'm basically doing them all in one take. So bear with, bear with. Brushes, or brushes. And you can see, see where the wear is on them. This could be a smash it job. Yes, I think it might be a smashing job. Oh, nearly forgot. Let me see. Oh, look at that, my camera.
There we go, there's a rotor. Well, there's copper in that, but I ain't going for that at the moment. Tiny bits of bass there. Tawny, tawny. So there we go. Bit of copper. Bit of copper. That's all we're after. And that's a Henry Hoover. Now I have to tidy my workshop up. Shop up. So yeah, like we're saying, if uh, you're new to this channel, this is the first video you've watched. Check out my other ones. It's all scrapping at the minute. I'm trying to get a bit of DIY. Oh, there's one DIY video, but I'm trying to get a bit more in. Um, just as and when it comes up. But I have got a load of circuit boards to strip out, so there's going to be. A couple of um, couple of vids doing the gold recovery and what else, whatever else. Uh, get copper off the circuit boards as well. But yeah, uh, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Um, if you like what you see, subscribe if you haven't already. Check out the other videos and uh, leave a comment if you've got anything to say or you want me to scrap something out. If I've got it, I'll do it. Yeah, all the best to you. Stay safe, guys. Catch you in the next one.